ladies and gentlemen of the jury, through the four person, have you reached a verdict? Yes. All right, and do you wish to read the verdicts? Sure. Okay. I would start with uh, count one. Count one. Okay. You have both of them. Will the defendant please stand? We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, guilty of involuntary manslaughter as charged in count one. We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, not guilty of tampering with evidence as charged in count two. All right, thank you. You may be seated. Let me get those forms, retrieve those forms from you. I'm going to do what's called polling the jury. What I need to put on the record is that this is your individual verdict, okay? So I'm going to start with the gentleman in the back. Is this your uh, verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Yes. Sir, is this your verdict? Yes. Sir, is this your verdict? Yes. Sir, is this your verdict? Yes, your Sir, is this your verdict? Yes. Sir, is this your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Ma'am, is this your verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Okay, thank you. All right, so you've completed your service. Um, thank you so much for um, being here. It was a, it was a long uh, trial. Uh, people may want to talk to you. Um, you know, this has been this pretty much a lot of publicity, and you don't have to, okay? So you can just simply say, I do not, do not wish to talk and move on, and if anybody bothers you, we really try to protect your privacy. If anybody bothers you, simply call um, uh, my division, and um, and uh, we'll we'll uh, figure out what to do. But you also may talk, okay? So it's entirely up to you, okay? Um, all right. So uh, I, I you can escort them out. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you. All right. All rise. George, just a minute. Just All right, you may be seated. All right, is there anything that the uh, state's requesting based upon the uh, verdict? Uh, we would request that Ms. Gutierrez be taken into custody. Mr. Bowles? Your Honor, we would request uh, under, I'm gonna pull up the rule, Your Honor. You got our rule 5402, uh, release pending sentencing. Uh, in this court's discretion, under the same conditions or other conditions as this court would uh, deem necessary. Ms. Gutierrez has been on uh, conditions. She has not violated those conditions. She has voluntarily appeared at all court proceedings. Um, Your Honor, I would request this court to continue conditions or whatever conditions this court would have release. All right, thank you. I'm going to remand you, and the reason why I'm going to remand you is you are now convicted, and so, um, and this is a death. It's an, uh, uh, a criminal negligence, but it's still a death, and so, uh, deputies, you're going to take her into custody, and we will set a sentencing date. What is the best, uh, what, do, what do we want to look like on that? And we need an order of remand, do we? Okay. Uh, Council? Uh, in terms of the sentencing date? Yes. At, 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 at the court's convenience, will be available. Um, there are two weeks in May that I'm unavailable. Those are the last two weeks of May. All right. Mr. Bowles? Your Honor, as soon as uh, this court has time, we will be available. All right. So, uh, do you have any conflict like that? She said May. Do you have any conflict? I don't know uh, for sure, Your Honor, that I can. I do have other trials, but I think mid-May. Well, I can do it sooner. 
Okay. I just wonder if you had any conflicts along the way. I doesn't look like mid May, Your Honor. I, I do. I don't think I have any conflicts. Uh, I'm sorry, not understanding. Do you have okay? We're in March. Do you have do you have early, do you have time before May? We have time in April. Okay. Sure. All right. Okay. All right. Anything else before the court? Nothing from the state, Your Honor. No, Your Honor. All right. Thank you. We're in a recess.